If you don't think mushrooms can influence the minds of their hosts, look no further than this video. Spores from a parasitic fungus called cordyceps have infiltrated their bodies and their minds. Bullet ants in the Amazon eat cordycep mushrooms, which co-opt their brains and movements and literally mind control them onto higher ground where a fruiting body sprouts from the head of the ants. Cordyceps can wipe out entire ant colonies. I mean, it's easy to say things in nature like that are completely autonomic. They're not, they're not conscious, but it does feel like there's some sort of intentionality around sustainability. Do you have slime mold sort of if you put scat in the shape of the Japanese subway system, the slime mold can figure out a more efficient route than the actual Japanese subway system. Do we know whose agenda is it? Is it the mushroom's agenda? Is it a more holistic being and mushrooms are the servants of that higher being? I do think that they're selfish, but at the same time, they're selfish through a lens of like harmony.